welcome to another episode of Lori's Learning Journey. Today, we ask the question, does being grateful really help? If you're like me, you may have come across what some people call toxic positivity, where we're supposed to just be grateful for every single thing. Eck, no. But on the other hand, does being grateful really help? What do you think? Here's the deal. It does help, and there's a reason why. When you are grateful, and I don't mean just intellectually grateful, I want you to think right now, do this with me, think about something that you are really grateful for and then feel it. I'm just gonna think about my cats. I'm so grateful for my cats. They're just like little love bugs, even though they are annoyed with me <laughs> and only tolerate me snuggling with them. And I'm just so grateful for them because it's a little bit of love and snuggles and supervision and delight in my day. And when I'm thinking about being grateful, I'm feeling grateful. And what happens when you feel grateful is the body chemistry changes. There's these, this whole endocrine system of endorphins, like you know the fight or flight thing. This is kind of the opposite of that. It literally fills your body with this gratitude and it changes your brain chemistry. So one thing that I started doing a while back when I was having a little bout of depression, someone suggested, think about three things you're grateful for right before you go to bed. And at first I was like, uh, I'm grateful for my socks, I'm grateful for my bed, I'm grateful for my cats. And then I started really letting myself, before I go off to sleep, just focus on a few things, maybe someone in your life, maybe it's flowers, maybe it's I live in New York City, or technology, or my body is healthy, I love my soap. You know, there can be something small that you're just and this just makes you happy. So I want you to take a moment and try this at home. What are you grateful for? And let yourself feel that. Maybe pick two more things. What are you grateful for? And let yourself feel that. And then see if that changes what happens in your day and how you feel. So that's it for today. Thank you so much for listening. I hope you liked it. Please like or comment. Please feel free to share it with a friend. I'd love it if you would subscribe. And also, if you have something you'd like to learn or something you want to share, please do. I look forward to it. Until next time, bye.